In today's video, I'm going to show you a funnel of a company which is well established based here in the UK. It's called British Telecom. So this happened last week when I was looking for a service because I just moved home to a brand new area. So I really wanted a very good internet connection. So I went to this website, bt.com. And what I found there was very, very interesting because this is, in fact, is what really got me excited about building sales funnels. So let me go through the process and let me show you how this actually works. So first of all, here, when you go to the website, you're greeted here with an offer. And if you've watched my videos before where I talk about funnels, I always talk about a landing page, which has some sort of an offer. So if it's a situation where you want to build leads, the offer can just be a freebie. This could be maybe a free ebook. It could be a free mini course. It could be a discount, whatever it is, but you need something that really gets people excited when they get to the landing page. So as you can see here, we have this um, landing page, which has a call to action. So here the offer is you can choose these JBL 650 live headphones uh, with this um, option. So let's see what happens when I click on see broadband deals. So I'm going to click here. And this is going to take me to a page where I can check availability. Of course, this is a much more um, maybe step which requires quite a lot of programming to check if the service is available in the actual area that you're from. But the concept still stays the same. As you will see, this is all about upsells, downsells, and making you buy more. Okay, so... Uh, over here, we also have a pop-up, but you know what? I'm not going to go with uh, this one here. I'm just going to say not now. So here, I'm going to check availability, and I'm just going to enter my postcode. So here, I'm going to enter. Okay, so that's my postcode here. So I'm going to check availability. Right, so I'm just going to choose any address here. I've just entered a random postcode. So let me go with this one here. Confirm address. Now, let's see what happens after this process. Right, so this is where the action begins. In fact, I need to get rid of these chats, these pop-ups. In fact, to be honest, they're quite annoying. But anyway, now let's take a look at what's here, what's available here. So as you can see here, we have this offer. So I can actually click on add and continue. So now this takes me to the next step. Now here are the upsells. So here we have uh, Smart Hub 2 plus complete Wi-Fi. So this is, an actually, uh, this is actually an upsell. So if I click here on add and continue, this £10 is actually added onto my order. Now take a look what's happening here at the top. Uh, we have the uh, th monthly 31 99 and we have the upfront of 9 99 So if I click here to add and continue, this is going to take me to the next step. And as you can see, my value here, my nine pounds has been added onto this. Now take a look here. We also have these other upsells and this is really, really exciting. To be honest, this website really got me excited about building funnels uh, in WordPress. Now take a look here. We have these uh, upsells here. We have the classic bundle here, free view plus uh, re-recordable box. Now if you click here on add and continue, this is going to add this 15 pounds a month. Okay, so let's say I'm going to skip that, skip that. In fact, I'm going to skip all this and just go ahead and click on Skip TV. Right, so on the next step here, notice that we also have more offers. So these are more upsells. So here now we have BT Sport on uh, Sky. This is uh, £16 a month. So I can also click here on Add and Continue. And when I click here, the price on the top here is going to increase. So let's see. Uh, BT Sports app. This is quite interesting. I'm going to click on add and continue. So that's another £10. Now notice what happens here. Now it's £51.99. Now we have a final offer here and this is a 4G SIM only plan. So here you can also add a SIM from BT if you don't have a um, mobile phone that has a contract. So you can actually go ahead and go with this one here. Now we also have more offers here and these are landlines which you can add and these are one times one time uh, offers for the handset and as you can see here the price says it was for 59.99 and now it's 39.99. Okay so these are like order bumps uh, if you have used click funnels or cart flows. Right, so when I scroll all the way down here this is my option now to hit checkout. So this now will take me to my checkout page. And uh, this is where I just have to confirm my information. Now, what I've just gone through here was a series of upsells 
and down sales and also options to actually skip the step if you don't need to go ahead with it. Now, the power of this is if you're a freelance designer or you want to build these funnels onto your own website, this is very, very effective. And in fact, it got me really excited, as I mentioned earlier on, because on your own website, you can actually add these offers, uh, also add the upsells, downsells, and checkout pages. The best option I've found so far to do this uh, on WordPress, if you use WordPress, is card flows. And I also have some videos that I've already done about card flows. It's fantastic. It makes the uh, creation of upsells and downsells uh, really, really <laughs> um, easy. Now, if you want to uh, check it out, I have some videos which I'll link to in the uh, video description below. And also, if you buy card flows, and you're brand new to uh, these funnels in WordPress, I, ha I also have a bonus that I'll give away uh, when you buy Cutflows using my affiliate link. And this is a course which will teach you how to get started with Cutflows and how to build your own funnels. Now, really think about this. If you're a freelance designer as well, you can start approaching companies or your existing clients to add these features to their website. So this is really exciting. In fact, yesterday I created a funnel that template that you can actually go ahead and download. Uh, it's professionally designed. You can actually use these uh, on your websites. It's absolutely absolutely free. So you can go and check it out again in this uh, video description. So let me know what you think. Do you have some websites you've come across that also incorporate these funnels? Please share them in the video description below or in the comments uh, below. I'll be very excited to see these because at the moment, this is something that's really getting me going. All right, guys, that's all I have for you in today's video. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next one.